take a look at the birthday girl. Thanks, Abigail. Of course. I'm your true friend till the end. Prue, do you need help? You don't want to burn your mouth. Then you won't be able to tell your loved ones how much you appreciate them. <sighs> <sighs> Abigail, could you just please... What? Treasure you? Honor you? Care about you? I'm trying, Prue. But I guess our time together means more to me than it does to you. <sighs> Abigail, of course I love you. And I care about what you've been saying. It's just... It scares me, okay? What do you mean? What scares you? Sorry, Lucky. I know none of this is about me, but your grandpa is the first person I really knew to pass away. It's okay. It doesn't feel okay. I never thought about, you know, death before. Now it's all I think about. And honestly, you're making it worse. I know you mean well, but you talk about the end and the time we have. It gives me the willies. That stuff scares me too. Really? Really. But talking about it makes me feel better. You know, my mom died way before she was supposed to. <sighs> Lucky, I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean to make you sad. See, this is why I don't want to talk about this stuff. It's okay. I'm trying to tell you... <sighs> she died, but that doesn't erase the life she lived. The people who loved her are still here, and as long as we remember her, she'll be alive in us. That... that does make me feel a little better. The same goes for your grandpa, Lucky. <laughs> <laughs> 